right. Yes? Yes. Not the slow motion? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so let's start again. Uh, this is the uh, manual, this is low water cut off. Mm -hmm. What you do is you let it run for well, let's say 30 seconds or till you get the clear, clean water. Mm -hmm. I don't want to do more because we're not going to be able to get yeah. it out. Right. I don't know. What it As it is, it's going to be it's going to be a problem. Well, <laughs> yes, okay. okay. We'll fail. Yeah. We'll and then, fail. yeah, yeah. So then, what you do, you have to every time you drain the manual reset low water cut off, you have to press this button reset, and you hear a click mm -hmm. first time. Second time, you don't hear a click. Because you make the float go down and it registers low water condition and it's not going to restart until you press the, the reset right. button. Mm -hmm. Now, this is, the, this is a uh, low water cutoff uh, drain. This is the boiler low point drain. What you do, <coughs> you open it up, you let it run a little bit. Now yeah, because before. because I opened up, it was a it, there was no air in the ah. system, so I created a vacuum. So, so I, I let the air in. So is that something one should do? Because yes, I would open up the skimming. Um... If the boiler is not uh, making steam, you can open it up. Okay. Okay. Or you can do is shut the boiler down, and then you can yeah. do that. Okay. Okay. So you open up the skimming point to let the air in. And you, you drain it a little bit, okay? Until like a 30 seconds, uh, a minute, or until you see it. Uh, I, I always notice when I, when I drain the, when I wet our old boiler, yeah. that if you, you, you opened up the valve on the low water cutoff and you let it go and it got, it got clear and then you closed it. And then if you opened it again, yeah, it was it was cloudy again. I mean, it, it's like it, it's like it 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 seemed to um, help it to shut it off and then turn it on again. You can, you can do that as well. Okay. Yeah. Keep pay pay attention that this low water cutoff registered the uh, low water condition. It has a red light. Right. So it's gonna wait for a minute or two, and it's gonna turn on the feeder. Okay, so while we draining, you can drain until you see the clear water. Mm -hmm. You can do it in a few, few steps mm -hmm. if you like. So we gotta run soon. Huh? Gotta run in a few minutes. Okay, so now you see, yeah. you you can you can wait, or what you can do you can open the bypass or feed it manually. And you watch the lower, the, you see? Now, when you open this uh, valve, what happens next is that the water level goes up and you see the water going through the skimmer. Mm -hmm. Because uh, the water level went a little bit below the skim point, so it has to feel now. So we have to empty the bucket. Let me do that. Oh, no.